12 habits to nurture and develop this new year habit number three forgiveness now when we talk about forgiveness we are talking about the ability to show others mercy it is such a blessing to show others mercy for the wrongs they have done to us for the things they said about us for the things they did against us that was unpleasant when it came to our knowledge and understanding forgiveness is such a beautiful gift that we can be able to give others as well as ourselves because many a times there are situations and people that are just hard to let go but the word of God says that when you come before God praying you should forgive others so that God can forgive you of your trespasses this is to say that in as much as others have the tendency to err against you you equally have the tendency to err against others to err against yourself and to err against God that's why it's such a beautiful gift to forgive secondly it's also very good to forgive why because it frees us of the burden of carrying those people in our hearts they have moved on way on with their lives but we are still living in grudges and anguish and pain and bitterness how then can we be able to have the privilege of recognizing our blessings when we are too focused on not letting go of what happened in the past the things people did against us the situations we keep narrating the entire story in order to get self-pity in order to find some form of solace but the truth is in as much as unforgiveness is there in our hearts we are genuinely never happy we are genuinely never satisfied because we are wishing that something bad could happen to those people we are wishing that the situation could replay itself again and this is just out of our ego and pride that's why we don't want to let go that's why we don't want to forgive and sometimes it's just because we feel we were so hurt we were so disappointed how could this person do this to me this person was not there when i needed the person most and i genuinely get that there could be some really valid reasons as to why we are carrying hurts for a very long time against certain people but guess what you came to this world alone you're going to leave this world alone so why don't you let go of that person it's not that deep they don't really owe it to you yes they should have a responsibility to give it to you but they don't really owe it to you god sent you into this world so go back to god and ask him the questions that burden you and if god has said you should forgive so that he can forgive you why not forgive why not forgive even if it was your own parents your siblings your friends your families you're not the first there is nothing new under the sun look at joseph's brothers they sold him to slavery saul hated david despite all the love that this young man showed to him so yes your friends people you are kind to may not give it back to you like that but you don't have to carry on forgiveness all through your life how then are you able to find the energy to progress you know to focus on your own life so just free yourself give yourself the privilege to enjoy life by forgiving this new year i don't know about you but for me i really genuinely want to forgive people even before the offenses come and when the offenses come i should understand that this is man the bible says that jesus understood the hearts of men that's why he knew when to leave the crowd so sometimes you just need to pick up your bags and leave that environment you know you don't have to belong you don't have to fit in you don't have to be all that or try to prove a point just pick your back and leave that environment for the greater good you know but in everything forgive love the bible says that you should love the enemies you should give them water to drink you should provide for them when they are in need clothing shelter give to them it'll be like you're pouring coals of fire on their head you know express the goodness of god from within your heart onto everyone around you so that they can see the goodness of god in you and glorify god in heaven express the light of god within you by forgiving i know it's really hard it's really painful but god is saying this year you have to let go this year you have to forgive it's not just for them but it's equally for you and it's because it's a command that he has given that you should forgive so that he can forgive you do you know how many times you've aired against god you've gone astray you've broken the commandments of god you know the god has forgiven you do you know the many people that you've offended as well knowingly and unknowingly to you that is why my friend choose 
to forgive forgiveness is such a beautiful thing it's therapy to your soul it's healing it's comfort it's priceless just choose to forgive forgiveness means that i see what you did i know what you did but i chose to show you mercy regardless because you are human you are feeble you are frail the bible says that cursed is he that puts his trust in the arm of flesh i'm not putting my trust completely in you so yes you may disappoint me i get it yes you may not meet up to all of my expectations you could have done better but you did not either ways i still forgive you so forgive that your spouse forgive those your parents forgive those your friends forgive the people who have hurt you the most forgive yourself sometimes we forgive every other person except the person in front of the mirror you know living in regret doubt discouragement self-despondency accusing ourselves day and night after the enemy is busy accusing us before god then we just add more fuel to the fire by accusing ourselves living in regret repeating the scenarios of the past that we could have done better my friend god is calling you to a life of forgiveness so this new year make up your mind that i'm going to have a heart that is full of forgiveness i will forgive even before it happens after it happens i'll forgive others i'll forgive myself and i'll just learn to live in the presence of god so that i can equally enjoy the forgiveness of god as i forgive others oh yes it's really very important to nurture a habit of forgiveness to really forgive from our hearts to know when to leave the environments that are no longer for us and to know when to stay and make things right to make things right asking for forgiveness when it's necessary and just always forgiving others if the lord is telling you leave the environment these people mean no good for you leave if the lord is telling you stand still and see the salvation of thy god stand still but most importantly please forgive so that your heavenly father can forgive you and i pray in the name of jesus christ that this new year the lord will help us to be more forgiving of others of ourselves and to just have this divine nature of forgiveness from our hearts in jesus name happy number four check it out in the next video hey friends, hey friends thank, thank you so much for watching this video hope you were really blessed Please subscribe to our channel and turn on the post notification bell. Also, do not forget to follow us on all social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter. We encourage you to share this video and bless others. And oh yes, we encourage you to check out our other edifying videos on this platform to keep enjoying the moment. Thank, Thank you so much for watching and God bless you. Thank <laughs> you.